Hey guys, I'm gonna make this short and quick because I'm supposed to be in bed soon because I have to get up early for soccer practice tomorrow. But this is my review for Wizards of Waverly Place the movie. Now, first off, it was so much better than the series. Quality of the shots, picture, no, the special effects, the acting, the plot. It was kind of like how Hannah Montana the movie was better than Hannah Montana the show. Wizards of Waverly Place movie was better than Wizards of Waverly Place the show. Now, first off, I expected Harper to have a little sh smaller role than she actually did, to be honest. Um, so I was a surprise. And Alex and Justin, I mean Selena and David were just amazing. And JT Austin, as usual, cannot be described. It was just funny and amazing. And they really played the characters better than I actually saw them do it in the show, so it was definitely the better. Um, so now I'm going to talk about some spoilers, so if you haven't seen it yet, if it has, hasn't come out, or you ha didn't get a chance to see it tonight and you're going to see it tomorrow, then you might want to click away right now. Um, watch it. Come back. I'm sure you can f probably find it on YouTube in like five minutes. Um, but anyway, spoilers. When Alex won the wizarding contest, oh my god, I did not think that was going to happen. I thought that something was gonna happen beforehand with the stone when Teresa the mom got it I thought something was gonna happen there and no one was gonna win the wizarding contest and then when she just gave up the power I thought the spells that she was trying were gonna work but she they didn't so she had to give up her power with the stone so yeah okay so and the ending was definitely a really good one and I can't wait to see how season... What is it? Season 3 or season 4? I can't wait to see how that turns out. Okay, so everyone just subscribe. No button up there. Please subscribe. Check out my other reviews for Julie and Julie and Time Traveler's Wife. And spread the word.